Hello, Keisha. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm fine. Good. And so we're going to talk about your clothes. Uh, what's your relationship to, to fashion in general? Um, in your daily life, what do you like to wear? Well, I grew up on vintage because mm -hmm. I grew up not with very much money, so I always had to make do with just being creative with old vintage pieces and like things I would dig out of my mom's basement, which would be really beautiful vintage pieces from the 70s, but in, in school, I was, people didn't understand that. And um, now I've kind of developed more of a taste for fashion. Uh -huh. Now that I get to travel and see the world, and so that's why you have a so special style and and uh, and very beautiful, you know. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. I like to You're play welcome. with fashion. I think it's important uh -huh. to be able to take risks and also have fun with it. Mm -hmm. I don't take myself too too seriously, so I think it's also good to be able to play with clothes a little bit. Okay. And uh, for now, what do you wear? And tell us the, the story of your clothes of today. Right, okay, well right now I'm wearing a Vanna Kava jacket, which I like is has hardware on it, but also has coattails. Uh -huh. So it's reminiscent of early 70s rock and roll, but Rolling Stones uh -huh. to me. That's why I like it. And then I also like playing with masculine and mixing it with feminine. I like button-up tops and looking like you're wearing a suit, but then making the skirt really, really short to make it kind of sexy and feminine. You're not wearing ties, uh, tights today. No. And um, it's kind of a, a landmark, if I can say so, uh, in your style. Yeah. I usually wear tights on stage. Uh -huh. um, I kind of am known for my ripped-up stockings, which is still a staple. I love ripped-up stockings, but I'm just trying something new today. <laughs> and where do you get them, your tights? My tights? Mm -hmm. I uh, get those at the, um, the sex shops. Really? Yeah. They have the best That's tights funny. at sex shops. Mm -hmm. And they have the best, like, undergarments, lingerie pieces. Uh -huh. It's fun to play with. And what about your shoes? That My shoes? I got too. these in Camden in London uh -huh. from some punk store. I forget which one. The you creepers. don't remember the name? <laughs> no. Your makeup now, it's quite discreet. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I started wearing glitter and eyeliner because I had no idea how to put on makeup. So I would just smear glitter everywhere and run around. And I kind of wanted to look like David Bowie or something. But now I kind of am going for a little bit, a little bit more sophisticated. But then on stage, I go crazy. I like doing a, a trademark look, which is black almost mascara running look down my face. It was inspired mm -hmm. by Alice Cooper and Kiss. It's very dramatic. Okay. Very glam rock. And what do you like to wear um, in your daily life? In my daily life? Yeah. Well, I still love ripped up stockings and tiny short shorts and vintage rocker t-shirts. I think I'll always love vintage t-shirts. I have a collection mm -hmm. of maybe 400 really soft old rock and roll t-shirts. Okay. It's an obsession. Mm -hmm. But I've started to branch out a little bit more, and I really am liking suits on women, which is very much in style right now. Mm. I like mixing print on print. Okay. It just reminds me of the Rolling Stones. I just try to look as much like Keith Richards as possible. <laughs> okay. But as a girl, <laughs> yeah, in a sexy way. <laughs> okay, thank you, Keisha. Yeah, thank I think you. we've done. Cool. Right. Thank you very much. That was great.